Hello. I've just been told something at work that's a little bit irritating um, and it's got me thinking about the past and it's that we've been told we have to work bank holidays <clears throat> which is annoying because when I first started working I got a job for a shop called Index they don't exist anymore but when I first started working for them bank holidays were optional they used to beg us to work them and uh, Sundays all, sh all retail shops are closed and I think we should go back to that I've made a video about that you can go and look that up if you want um, but yeah so uh, th what I'm going to say is this so where they've er eroded all our rights as workers um, and I'm in the union it doesn't mean anything they can't do anything they've got no teeth um, <coughs> so I got this job in 1999 and when I, like I said we didn't have to work bank holidays and, we, and Sundays we were closed and then it started to creep in slowly first of all it was you know uh, we work on Sunday you get triple time yeah I work on Sunday for triple time then uh, a bit later on not sure how long a few years maybe at the most it went no not even that I think about six months to a year it went down to well if you work on Sunday you get double time what happened to triple time no it's double time all right I'll do it then the next thing it was, will you, will you work on Sunday? Do I get double time? No, it's just normal pay now. Or it might be time and a half, I'm not sure. I don't think it is these days though. They consider it to be a normal day. And I was told by one of the managers, Sunday's just a normal day. Well, if it's a normal day, why do all the shops open at half 10 and close at half four? When the rest of the week, the shops, or our shop anyway, is open from half eight till half nine. That's not a normal day then, is it? If it's not even half the amount of time or whatever, it's less hours anyway. So that's annoying. You know, they, they expect you to work on a Sunday. Sunday should be a day when retail isn't open. I don't care. You'd, nobody needs anything from like shops like Tesco or Asda or Curry's that they can't wait a day for. I don't care. You know, and if you can't, then you're pathetic. If you can't wait for a tablet or a phone one day, then you got it bad. You got a real bad addiction, as far as I'm concerned. I think smartphones are a bad idea as well. I mean, I'm talking to you on one now, I know. But uh, anyway, I'm not getting into that. Maybe I'll do that on another video. Anyway, and then bank holidays. Bank holidays were optional. You know, it was a favour. You know, come in and work on a bank holiday, you get extra money. Then over time, it's become... Well, we have an agreement with the union that if you were, you have to work so many bank holidays and then it was, mm. well, if you don't want to work the bank holidays, it comes out your holiday time. Why? Since when? Nobody asked me about that. Did anybody ask you? It's a rip-off. Why do they have the right, the right to take away our perks? You know, the job I've got's not great. I'm not going to say where I work, but it's not great. Index, working for Index wasn't great. <coughs> It was terrible, actually. Index was really bad in a lot of ways. I mean, it was man I could bear it, but... <coughs> like, you know, management. Most of them were morons. And then, you know... It's like, I don't know, how can I say? It's like they, you have something and they just slowly whittle it away until you don't have it anymore. So you don't have any perks whatsoever. Um, it's like... It's not the same where I'm working now, but... When I first started working for Index, we used to get 25% discount. And then it went down to 15, and then it went down to 10. In fact, I think it went down to 20, then 15, then 10. Something like that, anyway. It's always in their favour, anyway. So I'm just crossing the road. Don't want to get run over. Um, anyway, what's going to say? Would, is it the same way you work anyway did you start maybe years ago and then you had all these perks and then they've slowly just taken them away from you has that been your experience you can tell me in the comment section if you want anyway I'm going to leave it there because I don't have too much else to say I mean I, I did start saying I don't think smartphones are a good idea I don't think the internet is a good idea I think the world is not a it's not a better place for the internet it's made the world worse it's made people rude and impatient and self-centered you know look up the word solipsism 
that'll tell you a lot that's what a lot of people are suffering from anyway i'm going to, like i said i'm going to leave it there so thanks for watching and if you like the video and want to give it a thumbs up then please do and if you're not subscribed please uh, consider subscribing but other than that thanks for watching and bye for now